Kimi K2 just breaking the internet in the AI field. It's another deep seek moment because this is revolutionary and it's an open source model which is specialized for the coding. Another deep seek moment because this model is making all the private models of OpenAI and Cloud fearful, even changing their strategies. In this video, I'm not going to bore you with the graphs, statistics, and numbers of Kimi. K2, although we're going to talk about that later, but for now, I'm going to tell you that how powerful this model is for you and how it is useful for you because I have created this Super Mario Bros. game just with one prompt using the Claude code. That means I'm going to show you how you can use the Kimi K2 with the Claude code, also with the VS code or cursor, how powerful it is, what is its limitations, what is its pricing compared to other amazing models like Sonnet and all of these things in this video, especially what people are thinking on the X platform about the Kimi K2. We're going to talk about everything. So let's get started. You know what happened is to create a video, I need to do a lot of research, a lot of practice and want to make the video really structured so that you can get the value from whatever time you are spending on my videos. But it's a little disappointing to see when people are not subscribing. I'm not talking about the you because you have already subscribed. But if you have not yet subscribed, please go and hit subscribe button because that motivate me to add more value, to add more time on creating the really amazing videos for you. And this is just one time. You need to just hit subscribe and from next time you just watch the video. And maybe you can also hit the like button which tell the algorithm to push this video to other viewers. Okay, so let's first go to the post on the X platform about the release of the Kimi K2. And here you can see all the different things. But to note here, the company behind the Kimi K2 is Moonshot.ai. This is Chinese company, again, as I told you. And to get started with the Kimi K2, how it is, how it performed, you can visit the Kimi.ai, another amazing domain name and another amazing chat window. It's just like the uh, OpenAI chat GPT and we can start. So I just say, hey, and let's see how this is going. So the problem with the Kimi K2 is the only limitation is it is slow. Yeah, it's really, really slow compared to the other models, obviously. And this is giving you the unlimited access. That means this chat bot or the chat platform is 100% free. No limitations. You can ask anything you want. You can ask as many questions as you want throughout the day. It's all yours. But keep in mind, this is a Chinese model, so you need to keep all the secrets and the sensitive data on up to you, should not give to this model. And this model is really amazing because it is having the search internet. So what is the temperature in indoor city? So this is going to find out the temperature here. And one more thing is, you can see the sidebar is giving all the search uh, platforms or the websites it did for the result. And it's really amazing. You can just, just browse. It's like a Google search, but giving you the final result as the AI summary and the links it is just uh, getting for the proper result. You can actually paste the code as long as you want because it is having high context window of 128k that means you can have a really huge context here now let's move to the api part you can use this kimi k2 through api also and for that you need to visit the platform.moonshot ai this is the moonshot ai console where you can get all the information about not only just the kimi k2 but other models too to check for the pricing, I always go to the open router. You can also try this uh, Kimi K2 on the open router. And here you can see the open router says it's uh, per million token is $0.55, just $0.55. Now what about the Sonnet 4? So if I go to the Sonnet 4 and see the pricing of the Sonnet 4, you can see it is huge, $3 per million token. How it is possible? $3, 0.55. Okay, so now I just do this. It's five times cheaper than the Sonnet. Wow, this is called Kimi K2 moment or I can say the deep seek moment. 
Now, as I told you, you can use the Kimi K2 on the open router, use the API of open router, or if you want to use directly the Kimi K2, then you can directly go to the platform.moonshot.ai/slash console. And here, what you need to do, you need to have a recharge of $10 at least to get started. And once you have that, you will get the voucher of $5, which I get, you may get or not, I don't know, but I get that and I have used for $0.115. Remember, I told you I created the game, just this one. I have used this twice, so I tried this twice and for two times the game creation, just it's $0.1157. This is insanely cheap. Now, to use this Kini K2 via API, obviously, once you have recharged, then go to the API keys, create the new API key. I am having this, so I can create it by saying tutorial to project is default, get that. And once we have that, then we need to use this on the cloud code. How we can do that? For that, you can visit this amazing Reddit post where it says like how you can use plot code with non-entropic model and the answer is very simple you need to use the entropic base url and entropic auth token for the kimi k2 now let's do that and for now i can say that i have used the cloud code to write a story about the love life of mouse and keyboard and for that entropic charge to me like 0 0.06 dollar okay that's not a good thing I'm going to switch to the Kimi K2 here. What I'm going to do, I'm going to just get out of there and then I say entropic base URL is this and another is entropic uh, key which I just created is this one. Now, if I start the Claude, I need to say Claude, Claude, Claude. I can spell, yes, yeah. I can spell now Claude and once again if I try to get me the story of love life of the mouse and the keyboard this time instead of getting the AI from Entropic it's going to use the Kimi K2 let's get here and we should see that we will not going to be charged in the Entropic dashboard you can see still 0.6 is still instead if you go here and go to the usage not usage limit recharge overview yeah on the overview soon you will see that this is going to be increased so now let's ask uh, kini k2 to improve this uh, super mario bros to have more complexity so i'm still on the same um, game here uh, we have the mario i'm going to start the cloud and i will say uh, can you please make this game a little more complex and we need to wait for this because as i told you kimi k2 is little slower so we need to wait for this to complete the task and i will come back but what i thought is instead of just waiting for this can we just move to the vs code and see how we can use the kimi k2 inside the vs code to do something okay for this i'm again going to open this game and i need to trust and what i'm going to do i'm going to go to the cursor no not cursor the vs code extension and i'm going to search for clean and clean is another amazing extension which is going to help you for your coding journey so i'm going to install it and once this is installed then what we need to do we need to just search for clean and focus on the view here we need to use your own API instead of open router. I will say I need the entropic. Remember, we are using the entropic way of using this Kimi K2. And uh, here, what we need to do, I have this API key. But instead of this, I'm going to use the custom URL for the Kimi K2, which is basically moonshot AI. And then I just need to say slash and and tropic okay let's go so once we are done with this we can ask anything on this clean using the vs code for the project we have so what this project is all about okay this is going to ask for the project detail and while this is doing things 
well this is using the kimi k2 let's get back to our uh, here we have the clot code and it says it need to change something and yeah you have full permission and once it is done then we will see the improved version of our mario and while that is doing thing we can see this is giving us the detail this is a super mario cream da, 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 a lot of things is there and again it is a little slow this is all the limitation of kimi k2 for now but it is super powerful as i told you and for now while this this is doing a lot of things i still can see any update on the consumption this doesn't mean it's not using any credit it is using it's taking little time to reflect the consumption on the dashboard while clot code is working on updating the game using the kimi k2 let's go on twitter and see that once the kimi k2 was released sam altman tweeted like they are going to postpone their open weight model release why they are doing it they are doing it for the safety reason but we know that everything is about the competition everything is about who is the best and to have that thing it is really really powerful to see the impact of chinese model over us ai ecosystem but why all these big giants are concerned about the release of kimi k2 why this is so much fear because kimi k2 is having super duper statistics the number game is high on the bar you can see the agentic and competitive coding it is really closer to the entropic which is the best ever model we have till now it's the cloud for opus this is really really insanely powerful if you see the tool use the tool use is again very close to 66.1 and 67.1 against the cloud opus which is really heavy and really really costly like i am really not done with the opus opus is just eating the money but kimi k2 is yeah it's super cheap and you can see math and stem it's again powerful than any of the model we have here if you see the usage it's really powerful and if you see other benchmark like live coding benchmark kimi k2 is far about everything we have here you can check all the benchmarks like sway bench verified sway bench verified for agentic coding then we have the tau 2 for tool and we have a lot more math everywhere kimi k2 is performing the best and remind you that this is not a reasoning model it's just a normal non reasoning model which is super fast and giving you the power in your hand open sourced and the crazy thing about this is the loss versus token this graph shows that kimi k2 is so powerful that the loss versus token the token we send here and the loss in the information is very very less for kimi k2 which is why making this model super powerful now this graph also explain that initially the token was very less and the loss of information is huge but as we go further we increase the number of token to train this model when we reach the 15 trillion token on this kimi k2 the loss is very very less it is totally minimized and this is why the model performs so well okay finally let's move to the x platform and see what people are thinking about and saying about the kimi k2 this person says kimi k2 is basically deep seek v3 with the fewer head and more expert see exactly similar but fewer heads more expert good that's really what we need and people are using on vs code you can see people are using for the demonstration purpose and kimi k2 is all over the internet if you just see and this person has just created this game using kimi k2 it's amazing amazing again using the clot code so with that let's get back to the mario game and go to the clot code it has completed everything enhanced a lot of things and for now if i try to see this game is very very simple but if i reload this page yeah you can see this is great and now okay so this is you can see it is also moving the screen and yeah i can get that 
and oops, oops, okay. So this is how the powerful Kimi K2 is and if you have any thought about the Kimi K2 or you think that this model is something wrong, let me know in the comment section and what you are going to create with this Kimi K2. Before moving, before closing this video, let's just see how many tokens it has consumed. Now, not the token, like the how many... Um, how many credit it just <laughs> consumed so previously it was 115 it's now 156 so 1 0.156 minus 0 0.115 it's just 0 0.4 dollar for upgrading this game this is called the cost effective model with a real power so with that if you want me to create more video you need to do one thing just hit on the subscribe button and see the real power of the models of the AI on this channel. I'm going to keep updating you with the things I'm working on. So stay tuned with me on other platforms, especially on the LinkedIn and X platform. We will meet in the next video. Till then, goodbye.